My name is Susan Shepard. I'm a pediatrician with Doctors Without Borders Médecins Sans Frontières. For the last five years, I've worked in various countries around the world where malnutrition is contributing to such a large portion of childhood deaths. The U.S. runs a massive food aid system, churning out hundreds of thousands of tons of corn soybean meal. While this corn soybean cereal blend may relieve hunger, it is not the right food to treat malnutrition in young children. A young child, above all a malnourished child, needs high quality foods like milk and fish to regain weight, to recover from illness, and to grow. Not only does this system deliver a substandard food, it is wildly inefficient. U.S. law requires that the vast majority of food that we donate come from U.S. farms. So from farm to factory to shipping container, all this corn and all these soybeans must be grown, processed, and shipped by U.S.-based companies. Millions of dollars are wasted on manufacturing and shipping costs, when at least part of this money could be spent on better foods for malnourished and young children. In all the countries where I have worked, I come across tons of this corn soy blend. You can tell the sacks that come from the U.S. They're all marked gift of the American people. They're more like a false promise than a gift. Why would we be giving out food through a food aid program anywhere in the world that we wouldn't be using for our own kids and families? Mm -hmm. 